March 5th, Saints Adrian and Eubulus Martyrs. The seventh year of Diocletian's persecution, when Firmilian was governor of Palestine, Adrian and Eubulus came from Batania to Caesarea to visit the holy confessors. At the gates of the city they were asked their business and their destination, and they frankly acknowledged that they had come to minister to the followers of Jesus Christ. They were immediately brought before the president, by whose orders they were scourged. Their sides were torn with iron hooks, and they were condemned to be thrown to the wild beasts. Two days later, at the local festival of the goddess Fortune, Adrian was first exposed to a lion which mangled but did not kill him, and then slain with a sword. Eubulus suffered a similar fate a day or two after. The judge had offered him his liberty if he would sacrifice to idols. But the saint preferred to die, and was the last to suffer at Caesarea in this persecution, which had lasted twelve years, under three successive governors, Flavian, Urban, and Firmilian. Retribution soon overtook Firmilian, for that same year he fell into disgrace and was beheaded by the emperor's order, as his predecessor, Urban, had been two years previously. It is vain that we take the name of Christians or pretend to follow Christ unless we carry our crosses after him. It is in vain that we hope to share in his glory and in his kingdom if we do not accept the condition. We cannot arrive at heaven by any other road but that which Christ held, who bequeathed his cross to all his elect as their portion and inheritance of this world.